Hello YouTube family, <laughs> it's your girl Tiger. Um, I'm attempting something and oh my God, the way I got this camera rigged so I can try to record this video, y'all, I just, I don't know. I don't know if it's gonna work, I don't know. Okay, um, I'm just trying to do like some reinforcements to my lace front. And so what I was going to do was lift it up a little bit and even though it feel like it's everything is pretty good right now I'm going to use a little of this um, got to be glued um because I want it I want it to I want it to stay secure and Plus, I wanted to try the got to be glued because I never tried it before. I bought this like a month ago, and this will be my first time using it. Mm -hmm. Okay. And so, what I'm doing is just putting it around the edges um, in the front, like where my baby hairs is at. <laughs> That part. I hope it don't make it. I hope it don't make my baby hairs turn white or nothing like that when it dry. Cause again, like I said, I've never used this stuff before. <laughs> and so, okay. And so I'm amateur at that part, as far as that goes. So and then, where's my blow dryer? Blow dryer here and so I'm gonna do this okay so I'm gonna set it and I'm gonna go around it just a little bit to make it kind of tacky okay and then I'm gonna take my lace front I'm gonna pull it back right there where that little line is at what <laughs> was like my part i could do some plucking or something that would make that a little bit better than what it is right now so gotta pull my wig down where i want it excuse me y'all having some issues doing that just kind of press on it okay that and just press on it a little bit shouldn't pull that at all a little bit more I'll try this at home folks okay a little bit more right there and then I'm gonna take my blue dryer different from how most people do it with they got to be glued but I'm not most people so I have to do it my way the bottom I don't really worry about so much I just use the comb for the bottom but the front I just like it to feel a little bit more secure so while that is drying right there and I might, you know, like pluck it a little more so I can just like open up my part just a little bit. And I don't have any tweezers, so I'm doing this with my fingers. And I'm pulling down, so, so I'm trying to. 
trying not to rip my lace. Um, okay. Really need to open it up <laughs> a little more in the middle, but I need to kind of leave that alone too. Same time to our friend. Other stuff I need. I don't want to make it too wide, but I just want to open it up a little more. And I am not a professional. I'm just going to open it up a little more so I can make it look a little bit more natural. Have the stuff I need when I start a video, like my comb. Okay. There it is right down there. enough to open up my part. <laughs> and again, <laughs> I am not a professional. I just do it how I do it. You don't even have to pluck your lace front if you don't want to. I just do it to make it look a little bit more natural. Which is because. Okay, so yeah. That's about how I want it to look now. So, my part is open up a little bit better. So, then I'm going to take this, um, this concealer I have right here, and it's like a creamy um, conditioner. I mean, concealer, and that's because, yeah, because um, I don't know what happened to my other thing, but. Just doing this to lighten up the spots of my cap that are dark, where you can see the lace. Just to make the lace look lighter, so you don't really see the knots as much. Let me try this other end. Looks a little dark right there. I mean, and you don't have to do this, you know, like, everybody don't do this. Some of us just so fucking extra. Okay. Just so, like, at least from afar, it look a little bit more natural. And then I'm going to blow dry it again. Just to make sure that my got to be glued um, technique um, worked a little better. Now, okay, um, this video is not about makeup or 
anything like that but for the sake of video purposes before i do that um i have some africa's best coconut growth oil and of course this is not for growth for my wig but i just like to put a little bit of this on it before i try to flat iron this wig that i have never flat ironed before just so i don't ruin it <clears throat> Hopefully, mm -hmm. I'm not gonna go like full fledged in when I start flat ironing it before I see if it melts or not. <laughs> okay, so now that I got the um, okay, so we're we're not really doing like a makeup video, but for the purposes of the video. I'm gonna do a little sum sum, and of course I'm gonna start with my under eyes because like a raccoon underneath my eyes. So we want to try to conceal that a little bit, and make my eyebrow section look a little bit more cleaner because they need to be done really okay really don't like to wear a lot of um, makeup but them dark eyes do need some concealing sometimes so sometimes I just be like fuck it they can think I'm tired if they want I don't care <laughs> okay so I just put a little concealer and and now I'm gonna let me see I don't have anything that I need me doing my makeup is completely random right now um wasn't like really planned so bear with me <laughs> okay so I have some precious mineral blush uh here natural glow and 